A few weeks ago, I got approached by a man by the name of Jade and Yuki on Messenger. No, 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 not that one. This one actually had some Digimon cards for sale. And if you've been a regular to the channel, then perhaps you remember this moment. And maybe over the years, when I come across a, a better condition one, I can still replace them, of course, but... Uh... Yeah, so, uh, I did a little thingy. I promised myself I wouldn't, but Jaden gave me the opportunity. So today, <laughs> we're gonna open this little thingy here. And then maybe you can already tell, there are some Digimon cards. And seeing as I just teased you with the old video, you may also know what's inside. Because, let's have a look, ladies and gents, what I bought from Jaden are two, Jesus Christ, I can get them open, are two uh, Digimon Digi Battle cards that are pretty damn rare. Because the cards are these two. Are you ready? Boom! <laughs> we have here a Millennium Mon and Apucarimon from the French Digi Battle Series 3 set. Now I've made an entire video on, on the history of this set, uh, so I'm not gonna repeat it, but basically it's a set that only got printed in French and they're very damn rare to find, especially the hollows, such as these two. They're one of the most expensive cards in all of Digi Battle history. And uh, I actually already had these two. I actually have two Apocarimon, but they're all very, very crappy condition. So uh, I bought these two from Jaden because they're actually in a very nice condition. Well, especially the Apocarimon. Here we go. Just gonna take them out of its little sleeve here. Gonna be very careful, of course. Oh, look at this. Apocarimon. I love this one so damn much. So yeah, look at that. Oh, this is so much better than the one I have. <laughs> look at that hollow. There is no dirt or anything on there. No scratches. Oh, that's perfect. That is honestly near mint condition. Well, yeah, there's a little small amount of lightning on the edge here. Very small amount, but definitely a near mint condition card. Um, so that's very nice. Then the Millennium on, I saw in pictures, was a little less. Now the front still looks very, very clean. The back has a couple of black spots. But still very sweet indeed. Oh, look at that. Yeah, that looks clean as hell though. That looks very, very sweet. Look at that. Also in a perfect condition. Yeah, the back, however, like I said, has some minor black, one of those black dots, you know. So that's a bit unfortunate. Maybe I can get them off, but, uh, you know, it's okay. It's definitely a improvement over the one that I have that you saw in the previous video. Very small nook here in the middle, but it's uh, otherwise than that, it's in a perfect condition still. And uh, the front looks very, very clean and neat. And I really do like that. So that is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So yeah, that's a little thing that I, uh, that I bought again. Uh, like I said, I didn't mean to. At least not so straight away, but he gave me an opportunity, he was looking for some money, and he offered them for a very nice price. I mean, it was still pricey, of course, but uh, I had to bite the bullet, like they say. I had to bite the bullet. And uh, now my uh, French Series 3 is all, all cards are as good as name in condition, or very lightly played condition, at least. So I'm, I, I'm very happy. I'm very, very happy with that. I am very, very happy with that. So gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. I one day will one day I will show you my entire collection. Don't worry, but for now you will have to be teased with these two. So, thank you for watching, and we will see each other in a next video. Take care, everybody. Bye bye.